Okay. Before I forget anything and I go to bed and forget everything that I was going to remember to do in the morning, because I'm that kind of person who wakes up in the morning, no, what's that going to do? So anyways, let's just do frying pan. Okay, so frying pan is a little bit more difficult. You can land it. I mostly like to tilt my can down so then when you pop it up, it just lands right there and it has like a space not to move. The more challenged, you know, the more people who are good at it might land it right there and then they just might spike it. And then, you know, big cup and then spin and then all that stuff. All right, so basically you can use your thumb for this if you want to practice. Just basically throw it up just like you're going to do big cup or small cup or tall cup. It's simple. It's simple physics. Now, people can't get fried pan. Then there is, you're obviously good. <laughs> so basically, you can just use your thumb for the first couple of tries, you know, just kind of throw it up a few times, make sure your thumb catches it. Then once you think you have the idea, you can actually try it out without your thumb. Oh, I obviously failed right there, but. And you also want the ball to land like, you know, softly so just kind of like bend your knees while the ball is coming down so that way it has a softer landing otherwise if it go if you go like this that could work too but my thumb was in the way that time no stop catching it you could just be like that and it could just roll up so kind of give it like a soft landing and if you want you know you could adjust it then you could go to spike and then you know you can do whatever you want after there but thanks for watching guys subscribe I would, I would love a new addition to the Ken Army and Ken Army or Ken Nation I don't know what I should call it but um uh, thanks for watching guys bye